You want to be debt broke? Don't pay yourself first. That one's easy. Spend more than you make. How about poor? Think about paying yourself first. Don't actually do it. Tell yourself someday. Middle class. You know, there's nothing. I'm not against being middle class, by the way. It's cool. Uh, this is the number. Save 5 to 10% of your income. If you're saving 5% of your income, you are not going to have massive financial security. Okay, now, the average 401k contribution in this country is between 3 to 6%. So if you're in here, everybody, some of the people at Create Alive are watching this and got lots of millennials watching this, don't save 6% of your income. Change this today. You know, my, one of my greatest victories was when I did the Oprah show on the Automatic Millionaire, I said my goal was to get 10 million Americans to pay themselves first and up what they were saving. And at Oprah, they used to, be able to watch the show live, and so many people that were watching that show live, went, after I left the building, they like went down to HR and either signed up for their 401k plan or increased their 401k plan, that the head of HR called the president and was like, what the hell is going on here today? <laughs> and they were like, oh, we had this guy David Bach come here and talk about that. This is what you need to do. This doesn't work. If only thing you do from being here today is I get you to change this, then my day here was worth it. So you pay yourself first. Here's the rich numbers. 10 to 15% upper middle class. Here's the formula for rich, pay yourself first. 15 to 20%. Here's the rich enough to retire early. 20%. And more is better. It's all perspective. Right? It's all perspective. You can do this. You decide, but make a decision. Where do I put it? These are the accounts. IRA account, spousal IRA, 401k plan, SEP IRA, three key plans, IRAs, 401k plans, and SEP IRAs. By the way, that SEP IRA number is $54,000 right now. That is a typo. Really worth saying here, depending on when you watch this, you got any questions on numbers that are here, go to irs.gov, you'll always be able to get the latest numbers. These numbers change every year. 